This is part 2 for Alstroemeri painting tutorial and we will be painting shiny Alstroemeri leaves with watercolors. An outline drawing is done. I'm removing the excess amount of graphite off and I'm painting on a different paper to show you exactly how I did this Alstroemeria leaves. We can mix watercolors. Adding water to palette. For the first mix, Sab Green. Lemon yellow, second mix, Seb Green, Ultramarine Blue, a little bit more of Seb Green. For the third mix, I'm taking Ultramarine Blue with a little touch of Lemon Yellow. Fourth mix, Sab Green. We can start painting. Covering with water, thin layer of water on the first leaf. And Looking at the reference, uh, you notice that this leaf has darker areas and the shiny area. So now I'm applying watercolor mix to the very darker area, which is visible on the reference, and leaving light area untouched. Carefully moving watercolor where I need them, working with the big synthetic brush. And now I'm taking ultramarine blue with a little touch of lemon yellow and apply very watery amount to the to that shiny area. Now maybe it looks uh, a bit dark. Don't be worried. Uh, this uh, layer is very thin, and when it will dry, it will become very light. I'm working with very transparent layers. It's very important to create this shiny look. And if you look closely to the reference, you will notice that in that shiny area, there are a lot of blues. That's why we are adding ultramarine blue to that exact area. Now with a clean and dry brush, I'm wiping out uh, watercolors from the vein, a uh, leaf vein area. watery layer of lemon yellow with a wider synthetic brush and I'm smoothing and applying another layer building realistic look layer by layer working accurately and the surface is dry when I'm applying watery layer of watercolors And 
and again with a thinner brush making those textured brush strokes and carefully going to the shiny area to create contrast and the shiny effect don't overpaint here really few marks and it will be the job will be done Now I'm at the finishing stage of this Alstrom area leaf painting and I hope you understand the technique. It's quite simple, just it is all about layering and transparency. Don't rush, really work it accurately and um, especially with the shiny area, don't overpaint it. All the other leaves are done the same. So hope you learned something new and hope this is really uh, helpful for you. Thanks for watching and see you in my next tutorials. Bye bye!